At Melbourne's Brizzy Brothers Gym, a handful of kids spend their Friday night pounding bags and swatting coaches' gloves. Hey, Jacob, come. Boxing may be the main event, but the skills learned here by the mostly Indigenous crowd go well beyond the sport. For Aboriginal teenager Kiwa Austin Rioli, that includes how better to cope with racism. Getting out there on the pads, doing all that force, like, you know, you can let everything out rather than keeping it in, which then, if something does happen, that annoys you instead of letting all your anger out that you have built up some of it's already gone through doing exercise especially boxing that's just one of the benefits to come from the weekly program started by troy austin's father in 1982. You know, speed and heroin were the big issues then uh, he wanted to create a safe environment for young people to feel uh, that they belong somewhere and that they could make a contribution. Since then, the risks facing Australia's Aboriginal population have not changed. Government statistics show they have a lower life expectancy than non-Aboriginal Australians and are more likely to be unemployed. Indigenous children are 26 times more likely to end up imprisoned. They account for more than half of all children currently in detention. You disengage from the education, um, could be, you know, um, alcohol and other substances uses, mental health problems, I mean, all of the above. That's why this program is still around, bringing community leaders, rising boxing stars and seasoned teachers together in one hall. You think about it, it gives the kids a safe place to go on a Friday night with positive role models and positive people around them. There's also a very basic lesson in all this, which is learning the art of self-defense, which people here will tell you is important. I feel safer going out now that I know a bit more about self-defence, you know, and my mum feels safer with me going out because I know self-defence. Organisers say one of the most important skills to come out of this ring is self-esteem and the knowledge that regardless of the statistics working against them, there are people in their community who are willing to help them put on the gloves and go to the ropes to ensure they have a shot at success. Greg Nabar, CGTN, Melbourne.